morning questions, or AM for short, morning questions. Are we still in the morning? How about a big uh, good morning to the guy? Everybody want a big good morning on three? One, two, three. Good morning. Okay, very good. The energy's, the energy's climbing here a little bit. <sighs> what kind of questions do you ask yourself every morning? These are called morning rituals, and there's some questions that we ask. Sometimes you ask the wrong question, you get your morning off on the wrong foot, then you have to recover later. Always ask the following questions. Please write them down, and we'll share a little bit here in just a moment. Number one question I'd like you to ask is, what am I happy about? Please write that down, what am I happy about? Would happiness be an excellent emotion, a gift to give yourself and others in the room? Yes or no? All right, look to your person next to you, or left, left or right, and send them a little happiness. Say happy. happy. Okay, good. Now. By the way, where are my morning people? Where are the morning people? Where are my evening people? The night, night owls. Where are those of you that are like weird and anomalies like me that are morning and night people? Anybody? Okay, there, you are a morning and a night person? I am too. What are you happy about? Write that down. And you know what I ask you to do real quick? Just jot down a quick word or phrase. What are you happy about in your life? And as you're doing that very quickly, if you're an advanced student today, I sense we have a few of you that are advanced, write the second question down. What are you grateful for? Someone once said, it's a great idea to live with an attitude of gratitude. Some of you are very familiar with the concept. Everybody say gratitude. gratitude. Oh, come on, like you're grateful for something. Say gratitude. gratitude. Good, good. A big, I'm, let's forget good morning. Let's do thank you. Everybody say thank you. Thank you. Okay, good. And let's say thank you in unison. We got our sponsors. We got Sadie helping to make things happen. We got Alan, great leadership, Edna, right? And I don't mean to be leaving anybody out, but how about a big thank you to everybody that helped make Gaddis happen and what's going on here? On three, give a hat. Thank you. There you go. Now, in your personal life, what you're thankful for could be Gaddis, but maybe I'd like you to go a little deeper and, and say something about your personal life that you're grateful for. You know, this morning for me, it was my eyesight. My eyesight, basic. You know, there was an immigrant. I, I was blessed to go to a Shelbyville barber yesterday, and I heard the coolest story. The owner of the barber shop had this guy, and he was distinctly different than a lot of, sorry to say, Americans. How many people know that immigrants that come here recognize the gifts that America has, sometimes more than the people that, that have been here for a long time? Yes or yes? Yes. And there was a guy that was from the Laos. He was from a, you know, he had a whole different story. And I said, that guy seems to be really grateful to work here in this barber shop. And he came over to me and he bows to the owner of the shop before he goes home. Thanks him like this. And he said, that guy right there has got a story. And he, I'm not going to go into the story today, but he told me about his background and how he had literally escaped from his country at the age of 16, left his family to come to America. And he said to himself, Wow, he said, you want to see a guy that's got gratitude? That guy's really thankful for his opportunity. Third thing that I'd ask you to ask, other, what are you happy about? What are you grateful for? The third thing would be, and this is a good one, for those of you that believe passion is important. How many people here know passion is important? What are you excited about in your life? You know, this morning, my conclusion was I was excited to speak to a great group of leadership here in Middle Tennessee, the Gaddis organization, because I know that the message that I share today, these questions are not just for you, but when you get these questions down, guess what you can do? You can turn around and give the gift of these questions to other people that you touch. And how many people know that that's a ripple effect that can go really, really nice out into the, out into the universe, right? Everybody say ripple effect. Ripple effect. 